Hello my fellow maniacs, welcome back, and today I'm going to be doing a LEGO Movie 2 blind bag six pack opening. Wow, that was really confusing. I have six of the LEGO Movie 2 blind bags right here, and I'm going to be opening all six of them up for you. So if you want to make your predictions as to which figures I have, or I got in these packs, leave a comment down below, and I'll let you know if you're, well, I guess you'll know if you're right or wrong. Um, I don't, okay, wow, why am I cutting this off camera? So, the thing I don't like about these new packs is that they change the foil... And now it's really hard to like feel of them up. So, oh, nice! I got blue hair, wild style. Where's the hair? Where's the, there's the hair. Okay. All right. I'm gonna have to readjust the camera angle here so you can actually see what I'm dumping out as opposed to me just picking it up like this. So, yeah, this was definitely one of the ones on my list that I wanted. Was the was the Blue Hair Wild style, especially since the she comes in a summer set, but it's an expensive summer set that I'm not planning on getting. All right, so the first figure I got was Blue Hair Wild style. Um, and another thing I don't like that they're doing now, is they put tape on this. Like, how am I supposed to get past that tape? Like, look at this. It's just, like, bleh. I can't get past that to even open it up. So, yeah, all right, got Blue Hair Wild style. Whoa, I dropped one. Alright, next pack. Yeah, so again, I don't like this new foil because it's harder to feel up. And then they put bags inside of bags, which makes them extra hard to feel up. And it's just very annoying and makes my life so much harder when I'm feeling it. Alright, who do we get in here? Oh yes, Abraham Lincoln. I wanted him because I really like his torso. Not necessarily anything else about the figure, but I really like the, the torso on this figure. Oh, I tore the top off. Go ahead and get him put together. None of these should be too hard to put together. I got the original Abraham Lincoln in the, the first Lego movie CMF line. And uh, his beard was squishy on the other one. And it's not on this one, which is kind of weird. But I'll live with it. It's fine. Boom. I don't know all of the names of these figures. I just know that this is Abraham Lincoln. And that's one of the figures I wanted. And it's the figure I got. So, there's Abraham Lincoln. Next one up. I don't know who this is. Um, I feel a lot of parts inside, so it might be Unikitty. Maybe. Right. Oh, it is Unikitty. All right. I've been wanting, uh, like, just a base Unikitty that's pink, because I never got her in the original sets. So, come on. Come on. There we go. All right, there should be everything in the bag. I'm gonna have to open up the instructions to put this one together. Oh boy. All right, and there is Unikitty all put together. I think it was a great idea um, on Lego's part just to put a base Unikitty in here, especially since there isn't like just a base pink Unikitty that comes in any of the other sets. Also, I was able to get this open so that I could, you know, put Unikitty together, and here's just all the figures. I don't want them all, but I wanted the ones that were really cool and that I found interesting. So yeah, all right, on to bag number four. Now, when I was in the Lego store feeling these up, there was one figure in particular that I really wanted, and it's the only reason I actually started feeling up the pack. And I think this might be yes. I wanted this version of Rex, the like the cowboy version with the hat and everything. This is the reason I ended up feeling up the packs, just because you know I felt like this Rex is so cool, and Rex is. Mm, Honestly, probably my favorite character in the entire, like, second movie. So, I really wanted this other version of Rex with the cowboy hat, because I thought it looked really cool. And it's just another Chris Pratt minifigure I can add to my collection of Chris Pratt minifigures. So, there is Rex Danger Vest. Now, let's move on to bag number five, which is the second to last bag. I don't remember which figures I have at this point. When I bought them, they were fresh in my mind, and I knew exactly which ones I had bought, and now I'm not entirely sure anymore, so we'll see. Who is this? It is Benny. Nice. Okay. Now, Benny does come in sets, and I know when they include when they include uh, figures that come in mainline sets, people get upset because they're like, oh, it's, it's, a, it's just a way for them to sell the figure easier. Why would you buy the bigger set? It's like a waste of a space. Well, for me, Benny only comes like this in the bigger sets that I don't want, like the Metal Beard one, and I didn't really particularly like that big Metal Beard set, so this was just an easy way for me to get Benny without having to actually buy the bigger set, and I'm okay with that. So here is Apocalypse Benny, which 
Now I can add this to my ever-growing figure, or my ever-growing collection of many figures that I have. So, yeah. Alright, now that I know which five those are, I know who should be in the last pack, and if he is not, then I'm going to be very disappointed. Because the final figure here, I almost cut my finger, be careful with scissors, kids. Drum roll, please, should be... Come on, come on. Yeah! Coffee Emmet, or like the Emmet with the headphones. That was the one, that was the other one I really wanted, aside aside from Rex. Uh, this was the other one I really wanted, was Emmet with the headphones and the phone and the coffee, and because I love Emmett. And again, it's just another Chris Pratt figure that I can add to my ever-growing collection of Chris Pratt figures, along with this brand new coffee cup mold, which is really cool, and the phone that says awesome, if I can get it to focus. Maybe? Ah, uh, I dropped it. Maybe I can get it to focus. There we go, yeah, phone says awesome, and it's a brand new coffee cup mold. So that was really cool. Alright, and there are the six figures I got in my LEGO Movie 2 blind bags. Whew. If you guys think I should do more of these blind bag opening videos, let me know. I'll definitely buy some. I might pick up the Disney minifigure series too. I don't know how I feel about those yet. I'll let them see if they grow on me. I didn't I wasn't particularly fond of these figures either, but they grow on me. So, yeah, if you guys want me to do more of these videos in the future, don't forget to leave it a like. You can also subscribe and hit that notification bell. That way you'll be notified every time I upload a brand new video. And if you want to see any of my other projects that I'm working on, you can check out my Instagram, which will be linked in the description. And I hope to see you guys in my next video. Peace out. Thank <laughs> you.